I could watch this. You and your team need Hold to get on. things done. With Monday.com, yeah, it's just easy, fun, in. and simple. Just add the workflow. Oh, you guys can still Whether hear it. Whether you're a small it. team or a big organization, Me muting it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Let me just skip the ad. There we go. Yeah, this here, Google Studio, I didn't even see this. I didn't know about it until, like, it's 29 minutes long. Maybe I could watch it, actually. You know what? What the heck? I'm going to watch this right now just to get it over with. Because I didn't know about this on June 6th. So, yeah, we finished watching Nintendo Direct. And we finished watching the Treehouse Life thing. I don't know if I'll watch it more tomorrow. It's until we at work tomorrow. What was that? So I clicked on that. I was just curious. But, eh, what the heck. Yeah, I guess I'll watch this. Let's check this out. Just so you can see my reaction on this or something. Like... I don't know, I just want to see what this is all about. Like, I already know about Google Stadia. But I never saw the press conference for it. And it's only, like, 29 minutes, so... Yeah, I could probably watch this. It's like, why not? You know what? Yeah, let's click on this. We're going to check out this next. That Nintendo one should have been the last one, but... Since I never saw this, I'm going to check this one out. We'll begin shortly. I can just skip ahead. That's how much I have to wait until you begin shortly. Ah! Well, let's... Oh, hold on. There it is. Let's get the head. Right here. There we go. Almost ready. 56. Yeah, I gotta check this one out. See what the, all the fuss about with Google Stadia. Mm-hmm. That's Stadia. Stadia Connect. Weird. I mean, come on. Cloud gaming? Bye. I'm Phil. Thanks Phil so Harris, much for so. joining us today for the first Stadia Connect. Hello. This series gives you a look at Stadia news, events, new titles, bonus features, and more. We'll be posting these Stadia Connect videos from time to time to bring you the latest from Google straight to all of you, the players. We got a that is quiet. bunch of exciting news to that share. Is so let's get started. That Three is quiet. Ago, we gave you a first look at Stadia, a yep. new generation game platform powered by the best of Google. Are Today, new? we're going to tell you about the about first it. wave of games available What? We'll share pricing details, Why would I do that? including an exclusive launch offer, and you'll learn how to become one of the first Stadia players. Not sure what I would do Stadia about that. Stadia has been years in the making across different Google teams. Google's mission has always been to make information mm. more accessible for everyone. With Stadia, our goal is to make gaming more accessible for everyone too. We designed Stadia to bring together game players and game watchers from around the world into one global community of gamers. And Stadia makes it easy to play your favorite games on any screen in your life. At launch later yeah. this year, That's you'll me. be able to play Stadia games on your TV. Monday.com is a ah, it it. my day used to be wasted on it. marketing. No, uh, stupid ads. Desktop. Oops. What was ads? Laptop. Rest in peace, ad. <laughs> Get out of here, ad. Starting with Pixel 3, as Pixel well as the brand 3. new Pixel 3a that we announced last month. He's so Where quiet. Are, Stadia lets you play the latest games. No downloads, no This patches, is so no quiet. Stalls, Do the filters, do it still. And you're in. This this is is ready. Availability represents a huge shift in the gaming world. Instead this is like Steam, PC, only different from what he said. As the platform. Google we that instead of a PC or console. Graphics, so there's no console required to play your favorite games. That's, that's weird. I don't know how I feel what I think about games. that. Today we're unveiling the hmm. very first wave of games coming to the platform. Still interesting though. We're working with hundreds of leading publishers and developers around the world to deliver their biggest and best titles to Stadia. We've lined up an incredible selection of games spanning nearly every genre, including fighting, sport, because it's Google, you know. Playing games, first-person action, and racing titles. Google can make that happen. Apparently, I guess. This comes straight from our friends at Larian Studios. Huh. Ooh, inappropriate for children. Uh, oh, it's Assassin's Creed on Stadia. Yeah. It's kind of like what they already do with Steam. 
the Steam Cloud has already exist. You know, they already had cloud gaming with Steam, you know? Now they're trying to do it with consoles. Now they're saying no console, not from the computer. And it's like straight from, oh jeez. What is up with, wrong with this guy? He's not doing well. Ew. Oh, that's just, oh jeez. What is happening? Oh god. Ew. What the heck? Oh, that's just nasty. Oh, come on. Oh, is he changing in the... What is that thing? It looks familiar. Oh, come on, the friggin' buffering. I know, okay then. That was weird. Weird, right? What the frick am I looking at? It looks like something from, from Starcraft. I'm not kidding. It literally looks like... Oh, that's... That's Baldur's Gate. No wonder. That explains a lot. That's Baldur's Gate. I don't remember seeing anything about that at the PC gaming show. So, Larian is a company where we try to give everybody a lot of freedom um, because we <laughs> want them to come guy. to the no, Thanks, man. Forget it. <laughs> My name is Sven Vinke. I am the founder and director of Larian Studios. So, Larian Studios was founded in 97 in Ghent, huh. in Belgium. I've seen the entire evolution of the games industry. We keep on driving the state of the art forward so fast. You don't have that in music, you don't have it in movies. Uh, but in video games, you have it, and Stadia is like the next leap. I mean, it is quite revolutionary. Larian Studios was founded to be able to create uh, big epic RPGs in which uh, the world reacts to what you're doing, in which you could play together with your friends. When we released Divinity Original Sin 1, I tried approaching Wizards of the Coast, trying to tell them that we should be the ones making Baldur's Gate 3. They didn't necessarily believe me back then, uh, but then we started making Divinity Original Sin 2. Ooh, well, I have a question. How much time said, until well, you I simply give up yeah. and announce Stadia yeah, will be closing this like you did with Google Talk or Google Plus or any of your other experiments? What the heck, Link? That's funny. I see what you're getting at there. Very, very, very hard. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. I mean, it's uh, people have been waiting on it for a very long time. Yeah, so can't believe they're doing this. In every single aspect, and it's shaping up to be a beautiful game. Thanks for that photo. We can't wait for you to play Baldur's Get Gate 3 to fix the follow. And whether you're playing an RPG like Baldur's Gate 3 or any of the other titles and genres we'll share today, what? we know that players demand the most responsive experiences from their games. And we have architected Stadia to give you the mm. fastest possible response between what your fingers are doing and what your eyes are seeing. Our so eyes are seeing. what does that mean for the internet really? connection you're on right now? Let's quickly dig into the numbers. Our highest quality gaming experience is remarkable with 4K HDR video at 60 frames. There's something wrong with it. Didn't appear on screen at all, did it? We're able to deliver. Chat didn't appear at all on screen, did it? With a connection speed of Sucks. around 35 megabits per second. I just realized that. With Google handling the processing throughout the whole stream. Smooth gameplay, even Darn if it. you don't have that kind of connection. So let's say you have a connection speed of just 10 megabits per Jeez. second. You can still get at least 720p video at 60 frames per second with stereo sound. We're mm. really proud of the experience we're able to deliver. And it's all thanks to more than 20 years of work at Google. Building and optimizing our networks and data centers to support services with billions of users like YouTube, Gmail, Android, Google Play, Maps, and of course, Google Search. The latency and speed demands of online gaming Google. are far off from the demands we've been meeting for years. We handle the back end so you can play the games you want, when you want, on whatever screen you prefer. Back in October of 2018, we put this idea to the test with Project Stream. We invited you to stream. stream Assassin's Creed Odyssey at up to 1080p and 60 frames per second. It was mm. a phenomenal gaming experience on a wide range of PCs and laptops that were simply running a Chrome browser. With Project Stream, through a web browser, that we can transmit not from your computer, from the data center to your screen, faster than your eye is transmitting those. I don't want to play a game through a web browser. That's critical for and not from the computer. 
like Mortal Kombat. It's truly a new paradigm for gaming. Mm. And since we announced Stadia a few months ago, we've gotten a lot of interest about this new... Hustlers. In our conversations and meetups with game developers, they're excited about the possibilities of an ever-evolving play experience. And we can't wait to get Stadia in the hands of gamers later this year. So mm. let's share some more details about the platform and what you'll need to get started at launch. You'll get the best experience playing with our new Stadia controller. Wow. Well, it's designed specifically for streaming. But there's games. nothing physical there. A capture button Just for controller, I guess. And a button to access the good PlayStation's ah, Epic Days of Play event. Stupid ads! Okay, get out of the way of freaking ads. Oh, that's a, that was neat. Spider Man. Of course, you can also play with any supported game controller or with a mouse and keyboard. The only other thing controller, is mouse and keyboard. To Want to play on the HDTV in your living room? Just plug in a Chromecast Ultra. If you'd rather play on your laptop, that's like desktop, Steam Link. Tablet, what Steam Chromecast tried to do. Window. Our vision is for Stadia to run on any screen that runs Chrome. Or you can mm. use the Stadia app on your Pixel 3. We'll be expanding to more screens down the line too, including more smartphones. When you're ready to play, the Stadia controller huh. connects directly to your game running in the Google Data Center. That direct connection is key to providing the highest possible performance and the best streaming experience. We have so many more details on the Stadia controller, which you can find at stadia.com. We're also a tweet away at Google Stadia to answer all your questions. We're very excited to introduce you to a number of new titles coming to Stadia at launch. Let's take a look. All right, now we're seeing the, the power. <laughs> Raised to be the alpha. Trying to follow. Alas, the beast can't be tamed that easy. Huh. What is this? Okay. Huh. This wild territory is the perfect den for my kind. Oh. Okay. A free world where I can roam and explore with no end. No end. No. Oh, there. Oh. I came here on the hunt. Hidden among sheep. Focused on their superficial dreams, moving up the food chain step by step. Dominate them oh, snap. No, that's just terrible. What's going on there? To secure the future with technology others developed, but were too fearful. Whoa. Those tanks. By tooth and claw, I took this island. And by tooth and claw, Look at that. I will rule it. Yeah. Credits of Smash. Microsoft in the credits of Smash. Oh. Yeah, it's so weird to see Microsoft in the credits of Smash. Oh, it's because of Banjo Kazooie? I know, right? The wolf knows when a predator nears. I think that's why they were working with Nintendo. They got Banjo in there. <laughs> One of the reasons it actually happened. I know. What a crossover. For the weak and the wounded here. Oh snap. She's ooh. Ah, like what is this game? We are wolves. Wolves. What are those things? They said they're wolves. Wolves. Look at this guy hiding, breathing. String connects to the future. What? That is weird. In position. Three, two, one. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon is over there too. It's on this thing too. It's kind of weird to not actually have the game, but only play the game on a web browser. And then when they do a Flash games on a web browser, and now it's actual games on a web browser instead of a Flash game. That's kind of weird. Well, I mean, it's kind of what, a little bit what already existed, but even more of what already existed. That's what it seems like. What's this little girl walking through town by herself? Get lost? Oh no. Dude, alone. This is creepy. Oh, snap. 
What the heck? Look at this is scary. Shoot, man. What chase the little girl for? Little girl walking through town. And this chased by something here. What's with the mannequins? Why mannequins? Stupid thing. Oh god. Ugh. Oh no. Look out. Oh god, that thing is weird upside down head. Uh oh. Galt? I don't know how you say that. Galt the goon? That was weird and creepy. What the heck? Dang. Holy crap, man. Look at him go. Yeah, carry those boxes and tables. Yeah, load it up. Come on, everybody, load it up. Come on, go, go, go. All right, let's go. We can do this. Let's push this thing. Yeah, go, go, go. Push it, push it, push it. Oh, oh, this is crazy! Woo! Woo yeah, around the circles! Oh. Couch and I'm on call off! Ah! This couch and I'm on call off! follow! This game is crazy, look at it! Thanks for following, dude! Ridiculous physics! This looks hilarious! Ah! Load up! Ah, look at it! Oh! Oh! The car! Woo! Fireworks! This is hilarious! Woo! Get attacked! Oh my god, look at the look on their faces! This patch in 2020! That is too funny! Oh my god, that was weird! Thanks for that follow, Spaceballs! Spaceballs! Like the movie Spaceballs? Get it? Ha! Huh. Fucking ad! Started in New York, spread not only Thanks for that, for that follow. Also across the world. And you, as an agent of the Strategic Homeland Division, has been called to Washington, D.C. to help take the city back and save the country. So one of the major challenges is to take an RPG and to... Is this Division? A fast-paced... Looks like Division. ...shooting game. We learned a ah. lot from the first game... And we improved on that. And what we have today, I think, is the best cover-based shooter RPG out there. Mm. One of the real benefits of choosing Washington, D.C. for the second game is that we have all of these amazing Luchy, yeah. buildings. The White House. No problem, the the Capitol, yet. We have yeah. the Air and Space Museum. Yeah. We have the Lincoln Memorial. And, of course, there's even oh, the, control control. the base of the Washington Monument. This looks like Division to me. You can play the game anywhere. Yeah, I get it. Anywhere. Really awesome. Seems like Google really is competing with... Uh, like, Microsoft is competing with Google on this whole thing. What a host! Host. Who said that host? Whoa, what was that? You see a missile? Rocket? Hey, blue ball. Blue ball and hero. Thanks for the host, dude. Seriously. No. We'll have to say that in the chat. It's all good. But, yeah, right. Wow. Everywhere. That's a look at just some of the amazing titles we're bringing Steam to already kind of does this, to be honest. You, you know Steam, where they had the Steam, Steam Link and everything? You can do this with Steam Link. Mix of games from lots Steam of already does this. Steam already has the cloud gaming. You can put your now Google's trying to do it. Really matter. The latest, greatest game experiences that you can play anywhere. To unlock these experiences, we're offering a premium subscription for our Stadia players. Introducing Stadia Pro. It delivers the best of Stadia for just $9.99 per month. Yeah, this reminds Stadia me of Pro Steam. Regular content that Only Google's doing it. For being a Stadia Pro member at our highest Only slightly level. different. 4K, HDR, 60 frames per second. 
with 5.1 it's like oh the steam controller steam link to celebrate players steam, players the steam box they tried to do a steam console know there's a passionate world of players out there who want bigger better more accessible gaming experiences after announcing stadia we've heard from so many gamers who share our excitement for those fans we've created a custom limited edition set of exclusive features and content we call it the stadia founders edition and you can pre-order it starting today the Founders Edition includes everything you need to get started with Stadia. And you'll have mm. your first access to Stadia when it launches later this year. We want to make sure your games look great on the biggest screen in your home. So the Founders Edition comes with a Chromecast Ultra for streaming it up to 4K HDR at 60 frames per mm. second directly to your TV. Huh. You'll also receive a limited edition Night Blue Stadia controller, controller. as well as huh. three months of Stadia Pro. And we know gaming is more fun. Yes, than I friends. did. The Founders Edition comes with a three month pass, so you can gift Stadia Pro access to a friend or family member. You can also pick up an additional Stadia controller for $69. Stadia controller. It comes in $69. White, just black. Those colors. And here's the best part about the Founders Edition you'll be mm. among the first players to secure your exclusive Stadia name. So you'll get the Stadia name you want and the bragging rights that go along with it. So you're getting a Chromecast Ultra the limited edition night blue stadia controller three months of stadia pro for you and a friend and you'll be among the first players to select a stadia name it's all in the stadia like a humor tag and it's coming to these 14 humor tag stadia new and we're working hard huh. to expand stadia to additional countries in 2020 and beyond we do have one more surprise Gamers who buy the Stadia Founders Edition will get the complete Destiny 2 experience as part of Stadia Pro. Let's take a look. Mm. Destiny's about being a super powerful hero. Set Destiny. Really beautiful world. The first time I We're fired my Destiny sword, on I here. Screaming. I'm so badass right now. I haven't played huh. for 30 years and I've never experienced that. Destiny is this about playing with your friends. Uh, My best moments are with other players. The first time I beat Vault of Class, I know who was right. there with me. And that just makes it feel of course. more rich. Bungie's always been at the forefront of uh. exploring new ways to bring our games to our players. We are now our own publisher. Did you know this? <laughs> and with Stadia, you get to be the tip of the spear with something that's new. Bungie, yep. Our push now is to remove all the barriers that we have to playing destiny whenever wherever huh? whomever you want and we're allowing players to have access to all of it all of our planets all of our cooperative strikes all of our competitive modes gambit raids it's all there for players to jump in shadow keep is the oh come on with a freaking tough friend it's a pretty haunting tale <laughs> there are these nightmares that are walking the moon and you'll have to find a way to conquer these nightmares and face your fears we have a lot to do with Destiny 2. Ooh. Not done yet. Yeah. We now are in control of our own destiny. Behind us, we have an incredible community. And with Stadia, I think we're going to open up an entirely new opportunity. Whoever was here last time wasn't it crazy? The yep, it was. Huh. What the heck was that? Like an ad thing? What does that say? Turn it. Still if it's buffering. We actually buffer like this while it's live. Where are you going, Google? You're <laughs> buffering. Space. Space, the final frontier. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? I can still hear their voices. Uh oh. Their endless torment reshapes our moon. Ah. Oh Nightmares God! Nightmares now stalk the surface, walking shadows, seeking vengeance. Oh God! Our old fears. They no. Rise again. No, not their old fears. Ah. What is this? And in the dark below. Ah. Something wicked. Wicked? Has awakened. Oh snap. Look at that thing. What are those things? We must bring an end to this suffering. One way. 
This new tools. Shadow Coop. Another. This is Destiny? That was Destiny? Huh. It's kind of what already exists, A but done differently by Google. With us to bring the full Destiny 2 experience to Stadia. The base game, all previous add-ons, the newest expansion, and the annual pass. They're all included in your Stadia Pro subscription. And as an added bonus, you'll be able to transfer your Destiny Guardian to Stadia from any other platforms. To recap, the Stadia Founders Edition comes with limited mm, edition. Yeah, it does control, look nice and good. Chromecast Ultra. It is. Three months of Stadia Pro. The full oh. Destiny 2 experience. First mm. dibs on your Stadia name and a buddy pass to give Stadia Pro to a yeah. friend for three months. Good luck to yeah, see. That's one way of looking at it. Sure. Everything up, that's almost $300 of value. And you'll get it all in the this thing. for just $129. Only two accessories. Now. We're excited to offer the Founders Edition to gamers around the world, but it's only available for a limited time in limited quantities. So don't wait too long to pre order. If you don't want the Founders Edition or Stadia Pro, you can still buy and play Stadia games without a subscription. Simply buy the games you want when you want them. We call this the you want this. And any games you purchase, they're yours to play whenever you want. So whether you're ready to go all in with the Founders Edition bundle, or if you prefer Stadia Base, you have options. All right, let's bring Phil back for a few final details oh. and surprises. Thanks for tuning in to this first look at some of our most yep. exciting launch titles, still for now. pricing details, and how to access Stadia right at launch. You can get more details and info at stadia.com slash FAQ, or you can find it in the description here. Or tweet us at Google Stadia. We'll have much more to come soon, including additional announcements Oops. from some of the world's best game publishers. Thanks for watching. I can't wait for you to experience Stadia for yourself. And with that, we're excited to show you one last collection of games. Listen up already. <laughs> wow. It was cyber, Cyberpunk. What's it called again? Shoot, Cyberpunk. It's all of that again. It's like so much of what they showed at E3 is in this thing. Yeah. Or all the ways we play. Huh? <laughs> it's like what they do with flash games now with actual games that would be on a console. It's kind of weird, but yeah, so it was nice. But this is good. No discs. No downloads. What the heck? Hmm. Well, so on stream, this stream, yeah. Early excitement. Yeah, early excitement. How I said it. You guys are weird. Ha! Who isn't weird? Never stops. Where well, you can play. How you want. Ah! Look at them trying to twist each other. Stay all. Well, they try and overhype it. Get people excited for it. Like, thanks for joining us. You're welcome. E3 2019. They showed that on June 6th. June 6th. They're the most, they're the earliest thing about E3 that happened. They happened way before E3 even began. Yeah, they had theirs early before E3. Yeah, it was their first conference. Ah! Follow. Ah! Yeah, I should have followed like a host. Oh, jeez. Oh.